Well, we're here with Matt Tabernow, who's going to be making his AFL debut this Sunday against North Melbourne. Matt, tell us how you're feeling right now. Yeah, obviously just found out. Um, pretty excited about you know the prospect of playing on Sunday, so it'll be yeah, looking forward to it. How exactly did you find out who gave you the news? Uh, I was named on the extended bench uh, last night, um, and Ross sort of confirmed it. Yeah, after training today, uh, Ross and Bondi. So yeah, that's how I found out. Has uh, Ross had a, a word to you? Has he given you any advice? Yeah, he said um, just go out and do what you've been doing. Give you know 100% effort, um, work hard, and yeah, he's given me a lot of you know tips throughout the year. Just you know giving me obviously been on the verge of emergency the last few games, and he sort of, sort of said just keep working at it, and yeah, you'll get your opportunity. So glad it's sort of happened. Yep. Was it a bit of a surprise today, or did, did you have a bit of a sneaky suspicion that you were getting close to being named? Um, oh. I was obviously, yeah, as I said, I was named on the extended bench, so you know, I was always in with a, with a chance, but um, yeah, still thought I had a little bit of work to do, but yeah, it's good to sort of get an opportunity. Now, you're one of those great stories, the guys who are uh, coming from the rookie list. Yeah. Uh, tell us, uh, share with us what you were doing a year ago. A year ago, um, yeah, I was uh, playing, um, playing local footy in Murray Bush Rangers in the TSC Cup. Um, Working as well, so finished school two years ago. So I was working last year. Yeah, so it's yeah, it's good to be, good to be here. Yep. Now you had, you had a compromised start to the pre-season this year. Can you share with the fans a little bit about the illness you had? Yeah. Uh, so just after we got back from the Christmas break in in pre-season, um, had glandular fever for for about a month's time. Um, so that sort of halted my my pre-season. Um, yeah, but I was I got over it, you know, pr pretty good, pretty well, um, and feel you know back to 100. percent So it's yeah. Yep. I noticed out on the uh, track today at training that uh, a few of the forward guys, a few of the leaders like uh, uh, Hayden Ballantyne and Chris Main and Michael Walters as well, were having a bit of a, a word to you. Can you share with us what what they tell you out there on the track? Yeah, just um, so these sort of forwards. Um, they just they just make sure I'm in the right spot, um, you know, doing my sort of role as, as a forward. So they obviously help the younger guys out, just where we're supposed to be positioning wise. So yeah. Now behind you right now, there's uh, yep. quite a few photos of Matthew Pavlich, who club yep. great. Uh, has he been a, as a you know a key forward? Has, has he given you a lot of advice since you've arrived at the club? Yeah, he's been good. Yeah, obviously being a forward, um, shared shared a few tips. Um, you know, he's sort of let me know that you know if I ever ever need any advice, just come and utilise him. So he's been been good with that, um, and it's good to sort of have him back in training the last few weeks. So, yeah. Does uh, the way he goes about it, his meticulous and professional nature, does that really give uh, like a young a young player like yourself a lot of uh, inspiration and and a, you know just a, a general way to see how to do things? Yeah, he's he's been good. Um, so that's a, obviously a really good example for the, young, the younger guys. Um, the way he trains, the way he approaches games. Uh, he sort of mentioned at the start of the year we sort of got a bit of a background when he first came to the club, what it was like, you know, how he approached it, and yeah, so it's good guidance. Have you uh, had a chance to call mum and dad yet? I uh, spoke to him briefly uh, just just before, um, not at length. I spoke to dad just about. Um, They'll be flying over, I think, on the Sunday or, or either tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I'll, I'll probably ring him later this Arvo again. So mm. yep. now on Sunday, what do um, what do you think your teammates will be expecting of you? Um, just give 100% yeah, effort, um, being a forward, just presenting at the ball, being an option. And yeah, so hopefully yeah, I can just play play that my role, and um, yeah, that should be good. Thanks, Matt. Good luck. Cheers.